This is better than coffee. The Miracle Morning. If you're not a morning person, then you are missing out on life. Nowadays, it has almost become a ubiquitous thing for people to proudly proclaim that I am not a morning person. I hate the people that are so cheerful and happy in the morning. I used to be like that as well. If I woke up before 11 a.m., I used to literally be a zombie. There was nothing that could persuade me to actually be productive in the early hours of the day. In fact, if I did wake up early by mistake, I would waste away all the morning hours watching YouTube videos or using social media. That was until I read this book, The Miracle Morning by Hal Elrod. This was such an eye-opening book for me. The author overcame such extreme odds to become successful and in this book, he gives exactly how he did that. He shows how he used his morning ritual to accelerate his success. Here's the thing about life. Some of us get lucky in the beginning. Some of us win the genetic lottery, get rich parents and get a good education. But most of us have to earn our success. And that success isn't going to happen on its own. It's going to have to be a very deliberate process. And this miracle morning is going to be a huge step towards that. So what is this miracle morning? It's basically a morning ritual that you do every single day. It's just that simple. You do it until it becomes a habit and then you keep doing it. It is your compass for the rest of the day. When you do these rituals right off the bat during the day, you also set the tone for the rest of your day. It's a way of gaining momentum and getting ahead of everyone else. A lot of successful people have done more before 8 a.m. than most people do throughout their entire day. This morning ritual is designed to make that process easy for you. Hal Elrod has given the following system to kickstart your morning and make the most out of your day. Here it is. It's called Savers. Each letter in that stands for one thing that needs to be in your morning ritual. Let's get started. S for Silence. Meditation has proven scientific benefits. All you have to do is calm your mind for a few minutes. It gives you tremendous control over your thoughts and feelings. And if you can control your mind, you're already on the path to success. Here's how to get started with meditation if you're a complete beginner. Sit in a quiet place and set the timer for just 5 minutes. And then focus on your breathing and don't think. You will get a lot of thoughts and you will notice that you may start to feel some anxiety. Let it go. Breathe. Don't stress if you can't silence your brain immediately. It comes with practice. A for Affirmations I talked about this in a previous video I did on Think and Grow Rich. Write down what you want your ideal self to be like in the present tense and then read it aloud with emotion and intent. So if you want to start exercising more, write the affirmation. I take care of my health and exercise daily. Write similar affirmations for all areas of your life and then read them aloud in your morning ritual. V for Visualization Take a few minutes to realize exactly what you want your life to look like. Breathe deeply and pretend as if you're already living that life. This will set the tone for the rest of the day and make you actually want to work towards your dreams. E for Exercise Get the blood flowing. You don't have to make this your workout of the day, though you certainly can. The main point here is to get awake and more alert. Once you get the heart rate up, you will be wide awake and be ready for the rest of your day. You can even do just jumping jacks for one minute if you're really pressed for time. R for reading. Reading in the morning is a lot like taking a shower. It cleans your brain of all the clutter, especially if you're reading a classic. Read a good self-help book or a classic that has stood the test of time. Don't read fiction or anything else that doesn't really add value in the early hours of the day. You don't have to read a lot. Even 5 minutes is enough. You just have to make it a habit, like taking a shower or brushing your teeth. S for scribing. This is basically keeping a journal. Research has shown that people who keep a journal are far more likely to succeed than those who don't. Take a few minutes to write down how you feel. 
analyze yourself, find out your strengths and weaknesses. What I like to do is also write down a list of things that I want to accomplish during that day. This gives me a roadmap for the rest of the day and is immensely helpful in setting my priorities throughout the day. In Stephen Covey's 7 Habits of Highly Effective People, being proactive is one of the most foundational and important habits. This miracle morning is the best way to be proactive about achieving success in any area of your life. Readers of the book have found that they have increased their incomes, improved their relationships and health and just achieved a better quality of life. I can personally attest to the power of a morning ritual and you're missing out if you don't get this book and use it to transform your life. This is better than any cup of coffee that you can have in the morning. And as always, like and subscribe for more. Leave a comment letting me know what you think. Also let me know if you have any book suggestions. Thanks for watching.